How's, how's the new kid? Yeah, he's good. Uh, you know, my first meeting with him was this morning before practice, and seems like a very nice young man. And uh, you know, he's coming in with uh, good expectations and to learn and to get better and to see what his where he is and his level and what he needs to work on. I think those are all positive things. What's the plan for him here? Well, I mean, we were we were going to analyze that after practice. I think that uh, based on today's practice, he looked like he could go in, and us having some guys banged up, he looks like there's a good chance that he'll play tomorrow. You never know what's going to happen with these guys, but there's a risk in signing them. Do you consider them almost like draft picks, or are they a little further along in your mind? Well, I think a lot of times they definitely are further along because they've, you know, when they're not 18 years old. And when you're 18, you usually have to either go back to college or go back to junior for a couple of years, most players. And then you have a couple of years of the minors. And when you come in here now, what we get them is at least two years in and you get a chance to see where he's at. He's going to see where he's at, what he needs to work on. It's going to be faster. They're bigger. They're stronger, obviously. But uh, a lot of guys can make that transition. And, and we we'll both will have a good, end, a good uh, feeling for where we are. And when he leaves here, he'll know what he needs to work on this summer and what he needs to do to be a better pro for the following year. But uh, And we'll know the same. Anybody you can draw any perhaps comparison to that you had in Nashville or Florida that was kind of the same situation coming in? Well, Tyler Bozak was in the same bo situation coming here. I mean, there's players that have happened that we, I can't remember his name now. We had a player coming out of Miami, Ohio, and, and same situation, played some games. Didn't do great, but he was a big scorer in college. and. Uh, the next year he couldn't play in the American League, he got sent to the East Coast League. So, you know, it doesn't always work out, but uh, you definitely have an advantage. And the advantage as well is if you finish school, you're four years in, you're a little older, a little stronger, a little more mature. How big of a challenge do you think it is to go from playing for Penn State last week to the Toronto Maple Leafs potentially tomorrow night? Well, there's definitely a challenge. I mean, it's, it's a big challenge to go from the American League to the NHL. I mean, there's a difference there. And going from college to there, there's a difference. Some players can do it. But it's, it's a good, good experience for him. I mean, he's excited about it and uh, getting an opportunity. And I think it's really good to see where you are when you watch these guys. And the, the transition is the biggest thing I find. And strength and maturity. Those are the three things that, you know, are you mature enough? Are you strong enough? And the speed of the game and how quickly the puck can go from one way to the other way is, is the big difference. What is, what's the status on of Smith and Sill here? Well, they're both kind of banged up right now. so. Uh, we're hoping that we may get, I don't think we'll see Sill, but uh, there's, there's a chance, but uh, we're hoping. But uh, they may, may both be out, but we're hoping that we still can see if we can get him in. Peter Holland was out prior to, looked fine. Is there a chance that he may get in a game before the season's out? Or is that too I, early? I think so. I think he should be able to get back in. But uh, uh, he's coming along. Um, we had some good progress, so I think he, he can start skating here soon. So uh, with that being... We, I think we what we have still have like two and a half weeks and eight games, and so I think he should be able to have time to get get skating again and get back in. I think it'll be really good for for us for him to get back in and play some games before the end.